Welcome to Instant Replay Live. I'm playing Lobster Girl, and this is the second episode of uh, They Bleed Pixels. Yeah. Not vaguely pixels, as Joe thought I said last episode. I was sure he said that. <laughs> nope. <laughs> oh, saw blade. So, so let's. Oh yeah, let's talk about the game this time. Yeah. Um, there's some cool. Th I mean, like the, the controller are nice and tight, which is great. Oh, you gotta have some, some tight ass controls. But uh, so. Oh, uh, you, you bumped your head, sir. Yeah. <laughs> uh, the platforming actually reminds me of Super Meat Boy a little bit. The, oh, there's a thing there. Yeah, yeah, um, I can see that actually. The coolest thing actually I've seen so far is the way the the uh, checkpoint system works. Um, you build up the ability to make a checkpoint, um, mm -hmm. but you have to stand still to activate it. Yeah. So you could potentially go through more of the level to be like, if I'm confident I can keep going, right. I'll set my checkpoint a little bit farther ahead. Get ahead, ahead of this situation. That's a super yeah. cool interaction. I like that a lot. Yeah, um, yeah, it's, it's careful planning required and that kind of thing. You can't go up there. No. Oh, maybe. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Well, I'll tell you that. I don't know. Oh, I, I love go. the way you dissolve into pixels when you die. Yeah, it's like, great. They just fall away. It's like well, I bleed pixels. <laughs> yeah, it's like that. Um, it's like everything here bleeds kind of pixels. I already forgot how to do the forward kick. Oh, it's uh, just stand still and yeah. tap. All right. All right. Well, he's dead now. I guess that didn't matter too much. So that last episode, I just I had to ramble because it's been a while since Joe and I have been able to record. Actually, um, not recording like a a update video or something like that, like where we're just doing a let's play. I've had a lot of stuff with Rachel with Typing of the Dead, which is ongoing right now, and uh, Joe and I just had 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 powered through a huge set of Shadow of Mordor videos a couple weeks ago. But everything else in between has just been getting the channel, like, in a good place. So, and of course with the AdSense stuff going on, which that update will have come out like a um, week ago, I guess now. Um, but, uh, just so much stuff going on right now with us. I was, I had to gush. I had to get that story out. So I'm yeah. curious as to what people said yesterday <laughs> <laughs> on the comments. Um, um, but I we have other stories. Well, yeah, um, I, I feel like... <laughs> we mentioned it on the uh, last week, on the um, or two weeks ago, last week time, weird, whatever. Whatever time. Yeah, um, yeah but I, I, I just started a new job, which uh, oh yeah, it's pretty crazy. It's like it's way different from anything I've ever done. Is is it's a real job? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> That's being which being, is way different from anything you've ever done. Yeah, um, you know, <laughs> having it's, a real job. I mean, it's just and it like it's hard to actually put into words just how impactful it is on my general like state of being it's a job where i actually have room to grow and get legitimate raises but how, um, how impactful is it on your genital state of being um they swelled um oh no considerably <laughs> uh i don't want to know about that uh well, you, you asked I well mean, i mean you're supposed to just like politely decline to answer oh um, <laughs> that's the way this society works well i had to go to the hospital and get them drained uh, oh god there was a lot of extra stuff that I didn't think would be in there. There was uh, Stop. pineapple Stop. juice. I don't know how it got in there, but Stop. I'm thinking about making a uh, no uh, fer fermenting that, that pineapple juice. That we, I saved it in a bottle, so uh, I'm not going to really get up there. Could you stop dying, please? <laughs> I need to not go that way. Yeah. Um, no, but yeah, it's going to be delicious. That that uh, It's going to be like a schnapps. I want to call it general schnapps. <laughs> All right. <laughs> We're good. Uh, oh, actually, I've got a perfect segue for a story on my on my list of things to talk about. Considering we are are dealing with Lovecrafty and Eldritch creatures here, <laughs> is that what they are? I mean, I know you said that's what they are, but I uh, haven't. Well, if you get to the cutscene, which if you just mm. like live long enough to see cutscenes, hey, hey, listen here, <laughs> then you would see that um, the the whole premise is you're entering like a another dimension through your dreams of, like, creatures that are beyond, you know, and also they're tentacly in the, uh, in the cutscenes and such, so, you, you have lobster hands yourself, you are kind of, you know, yeah. that, that weird crustacean Lovecraftian look as well. Uh, okay. what goes on here? Oh, okay. There you go. I guess. Is that oh, really that what you were supposed mark. to do? I don't even know. Uh, probably. Okay. But all of that is to say that, um, I have been holding off on telling you that I pulled out a rather Lovecrafty and an Eldritch thing from your bathroom. <laughs> oh, please do tell. I, uh... First of all, I, I feel like this is bullshit in modern America. The job of unclogging a bathroom sink shouldn't require tools, 
and getting down on the floor and underneath the sink, right? Like we've got one of those little stopper sinks um, with the like the plunger action that makes it go up and down for the stopper. Okay. And like like almost all bathrooms in America are, and for some reason whoever engineered those things and currently mass engineers those things. Oh, you're gonna you're gonna get one of those cutscenes eventually. Uh, what's going on here? Okay. Um, whoever creates those things. Oh, you got a rank D. See, dreadful Dagon, another rank Lovecraftian. D. I wanted. No, no. <laughs> okay. Okay. Uh, go ahead and click through all this stuff. Um, whoever makes those things decides that they should be connected to the lower system as opposed to just like on a, on an upper system that would be easily unscrewed and removed. Mm -hmm. When they know that they get clogged up, like why would you not change that system? I have major issue with it. So I got down in there and I undid your sink and and pulled the stopper thing out. And when I lifted it, it was like this necrotic jellyfish of hair and soap. <laughs> and and I, I was like, I'm afraid to touch it. And I'm also <laughs> slightly afraid that it's going to reach out and try to touch me. <laughs> like, it Did is the it? most hideous thing. I I didn't name it. The Joe Witch Whore? Yeah. <laughs> Uh, I didn't name it, but I ended up um, taking some sort of metal piece of something, I can't remember what it was, and like scraping it off the stopper into the trash. But, but like, in a society, in a better world, where those kinds of things are more easily cleaned, that would never happen. Why don't we live in that world? Why? <laughs> Why is it so much work to clean a bathroom sink? And why must things from other worlds that will forever inhabit my nightmares be in that sink? It's got like gross like like icky like like jelly bits too from like soap and like stuff. Icarus? What? Icarus? I don't think Icarus is appropriate here. Is it not? Isn't that like 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 thick and sludgy and no. What is what? What's Icarus is a is a myth about a person who flew to the not sun. Icarus, like Icar. Oh, like Icar. Oh, okay. Well, if you say Icarus and then say not like Icarus, <laughs> you know what I mean. Well, clearly yes. you don't. But now uh, you do. Yeah. Okay. I'm oh, with shit. you. All right. All right. So. Oh. Should should we mention that we're not trying to beat this game, and that may be why oh. we care less about it? Yeah, I'm just. <laughs> we're we're basically just like doing this as a different kind of game to to give some uh, some breaks from the, the main tracks. We do that on weekends whenever we have a long game going, and uh, and this just happened to be the one we picked. Um, mm. But we know that like we're not going to finale this game. Like this is the finale, really. <laughs> like what you're watching now. So should we set a goal for you on like where you need to go with it? If I felt like there was anything that I was actually quite accomplishing, is there other boss fights? Well, mm, I don't think so. But could you like get through this level before we end? Um, eh, we'll see. All right, we're gonna try to get through a single just... level of this game, and then uh, hopefully, you know that that will feel like something. <laughs> I don't know. Um, uh, it won't. But you know, life is full of disappointment, so. That's true. <laughs> That's true. I have a random note here on my notes that says validated stupidity. What? I don't know what that means. Probably something about me. I mean, if... <laughs> it probably is. Ooh. Oh, God. I really don't know what that means. Um, I have one question for you, though, Joe. What's that? Do they still make cheese whiz? Wow. <laughs> Oh, are we going to explain that now? Uh, you are. Okay, well, first of all, <laughs> gotta love cheese with some hot dogs, right? Yeah. Um, that is like... You know what really makes it is the celery sauce. Oh my gosh. <laughs> um, so, <laughs> Nick was working like super late one night at home, like on call, or on like conference call. Yeah, we had this um, massive like hardware work stuff that had to be done. Um, I don't want to go into too much detail, but people, like network engineers had to be on a call late into the evening. Like midnight. And? Oh, uh, so, I mean, I was just sitting there, like, hanging out, and 
listening to the inane chatter of his co-workers. And I honestly don't remember the sequence of how it all, like, unfolded this, this tale of American... Well, it, it was just this, like, perfect, you walked into the room, mm-hmm. and we were waiting on something to happen that no one could take action until it happened. So people were just talking, and it was that very, like, like the most, like, generic office chatter that you could possibly imagine. Think, like, if you had to cast, or if you had to write a movie scene, but you didn't know what to say... So the thought of hot dog just popped in your mind. And you were like, I can make a conversation on hot dogs. <laughs> and so for some reason, all of these people start rambling about Chicago hot dogs. And like the, the varieties of hot dogs elsewhere in the world. And what makes a Chicago hot dog so good. And there was just like this one like generic male voice that was like, you know what really makes them is the celery salt they put on those. <laughs> and then other people like mumbling in agreement or whatever. Oh, yeah. And then salt. one voice rises above the others and it's like, do they still make cheese whiz? <laughs> <laughs> and it just it threw us into a complete laughing fit of <laughs> just like what what is life that this is what people talk about? <laughs> I mean that, I got a so cheese whiz though. Like, do, what, what do you guys think about it? Is it? Do you like it? Is it? Is it palatable to you, <laughs> Nick? Is it palatable to you even? <sighs> yeah, it's palatable. Ugh. Do I ever buy it? No. Do I like? I mean, it's palatable. That, that's fine. I, like, I can't even like. I look at the can of cheese whiz and I'm just like, <laughs> I can't like. It's one of those weird things. I'm not even a squeamish person. Like, show me guts and gore, whatever. Um, show me necrotic uh, alternate uh, dimension jellyfish from the bath bathroom yeah. sink. Right, I'm fine. It'd be a little gross, but whatever. Cheese whiz, though. It's like that's not cheese. That's that's a. Uh... Well, now that we've lost our ad sense, uh, maybe we'll uh, get a cheese whiz sponsorship <laughs> off of this stellar episode. Yeah. Um, <laughs> Joe, you haven't beaten this, and we're, we're running late. Do you think? No. One more life? <laughs> Alright, we'll give it one All more right. try just to get past that fucking just, scene. Just one more life, and then we're gonna go get some cheese whiz. Ugh. Oh, that, oh, oh, oh that's that's what's on the line. If you can't get through this, you have to eat a can of cheese whiz. Oh god! <laughs> um. Um. Alright. I didn't agree to the. No. I on the next instant replay live. Whiz. There's more, no way. It's more going cheese on whiz. Off. More cheese whiz in the next instant replay live. <laughs> Really kick it. Kick Yo, it. plans, free stroke, Sonic Golf. Sonic Golf.